Hello everybody, my name is Florent Brodziak and I'm with uh, okay. We are happy to have been selected this year for the Robot Challenge 2014 in the category of the Hacking the Arduino Robo. And uh, let me introduce our robot. Um, its name is AWBB for Arduino Wellbeing Bot. He is able to move freely in a place, uh, open or closed place and uh, is able to analyze the quality of its environment. So he has a lot of sensors uh, to measure uh, quality of air, light, sound, you will see later. And um, the goal is to rate a place by telling, okay, this place is good for humans or this place is nasty for humans. The main difficulties we had with this robot during programming was the lack of available memory with the two processors at MEL, uh, one for the control board and another one for the motor board, because a lot of devices was already integrated and uh, managed by these processors. So it was a real challenge, but we did it. Now let's talk about all the sensors of the AYBB robot. Um, we've got here the carbon dioxide sensor, here's the ultrasonic sensor and his servo, here the micro, the light sensor, the GPS, and the temperature and hygrometry sensor. Once we have collected all the data from the sensors, we are able to evaluate, to rate the surrounding environment. As you can see, we've got a rating of 18 um, and uh, it's a quite a good evaluation. Uh, as you can see, we've got a good carbon dioxide uh, level. It's minus one, it means, okay, it's normal level and uh, normal light, not too noisy here so after that we will transmit all this information over the internet via a bluetooth connection and using a smartphone or a tablet uh, it will come later in future version of uh, the robot and after we'll able to show all this data on a dedicated website the final goal is to see uh, to be able to see on the internet if each kind of places uh, like airport, railway station, anything else are good or not for humans. Bye bye.